What's up YouTube? Bobbles and Ball Cards back with another video. Um, I'm doing this one a little bit different guys. I uh, wanted to do this video uh, just recorded and uploaded. Um, I know some people don't want to jump on and watch an hour video when I do the lives and I wanted to give people the opportunity to uh, tune into this and maybe get a little bit of information and everything. Um, hopefully I can share uh, to help some people out um, but anyway I did this video uh, a few days ago talking about a purchase I made um, talked about the product a little bit and um, it arrived the purchase arrived it was a couple let's see it was like two days late um, because of the postal service had a huge scare the the package came in was completely destroyed. Um, luckily, big shout out to Sports Source too. They had the card wrapped up in bubble wrap as well, and it did arrive safely. Um, I, I was very scared. My wife texted me pictures when she got it out of the mail, and the envelope, uh, the the priority envelope that it came in was just it, it looked like it had been ran over. Um, so. I want to go ahead and show off the card. Um, if you already, if you don't already know, it is the 2020 Topps Chrome Ben Baller Edition Lewis Robert Rookie. Um, this product is not yet available on the market. Um, there's people that got the emails, that whole you know snafu with. The raffle everything else um, I heard boxes were supposed to be shipped on September 11th so this product will start popping up um, right now it looks like and I'll go ahead and flip over to the other screen um, it looks like boxes this is the last one is sold at auction for 625 um, but it looks like boxes are hovering right around 700 between seven and eight hundred dollars um, if you were one of the lucky ones to get one um, so uh, there's one that went for nine hundred they're all over the board but it looks like consistently about seven to eight hundred bucks for a box um, I am sure there are going to be breakers that have some of this product to do breaks with and that sort of thing um, and I think this is going to be a very good product. Um, there has not been any confirmation if Top Sapphire is coming out this year. I'm sure it will. Um, but I think this product could be in line with Sapphire. And that's why, you know, that's one of the reasons I went ahead and picked this card up. But anyway, um, you see I have two on the screen. You obviously can tell right away the baller card is much brighter um it it just it pops i mean i can even you know tilt the the regular but the the ben baller one it's like i don't know if they did the photo quality different or what um but it is a very nicely done card um you know, obviously here is the regular side by side you can see the name plate is different right here um, they split with the black and white. This one, it just has a standard nameplate, different font. Um, you see the, the diamond design on it, a little bit of iced out bling. This one, you just have the chrome. Um, then you have the logo, the Ben Baller logo up there with the Topps chrome hanging from it. Um, but if you just notice the picture quality, I think just the exposure they did something with the photo um the card just looks different it's brighter it almost looks cleaner um so that's one thing to to take note on um the back is just normal um it just says chrome card number 60 which is the same as the regular one so no difference there um the main design is just the logo difference, the the diamond design, um, and then obviously, like I said, the photo just looks a lot 
it, it looks a lot better. It's a lot more clear, brighter. Um, the card just like pops more than the regular. Um, now, for a little bit of information, um, they also included the pack that Ben Baller gave them when he gave them the card. Um, this is one of the ones he opened. And um, I just wanted to go over and show everybody if you are interested. Because um, I don't know if it's posted. And it's really hard to see with the light. Um, but there are the odds on it. Um, if you notice, there are no regular refractors in this product. It is only going to be colored parallels. And I'll read it off um, since I do know it's hard to see. But uh, green refractors are going to be 1 in 11 packs. Blue will be 1 in 14. Gold will be 1 in 21 packs. Um, and there's 24 packs per box. Um, orange is 1 in 41. Red are 1 in 202. Reds are number 2 5. So you should pop a red one every 10 boxes essentially less than 10 boxes um let's see nine boxes would be 180 yeah probably about one in nine boxes um for a red and then super fractors are one in 1006 um you can see it right there there's the red one in 202 um, so the odds are very, very good on this. It is a 200 card set. Um, and then you have the 85 inserts. Uh, those are two per box, one at, inserted at one in 12 packs. There is only gold, orange, red, and supers for those. Um, you can see it right there, gold, orange, red, and super. Uh, the golds come in at one in 161. Orange are 1 in 321. Red are 1 in 1614. Supers are 1 in 8,000. So there's speculation there is 8,000 boxes. Um, with these odds, somebody can probably figure out the math to get kind of a more definitive, but it's supposed to be less than 10,000 total boxes of this product. Um, and then the big one, I think these cards are going to be highly sought after. Um, I think, I don't know how many is in the, the set. I have not seen a confirmed checklist yet. Um, but there is a Lewis Robert of this, and I think it's going to sell for a pretty good chunk of coin. Um, but it's the Benz Diamonds. Those are one per box at 1 in 24 odds of getting one. Again, there's gold, orange, red, and super. Uh, you can see that right there, Ben's diamonds. And there's the orange, red, and super. Um, you can see golds are 1 in 269. Orange are 1 in 537. Red are 1 in 2667. And supers are 1 in 12,800. Now, there's autos. Um, I do also do not know the autograph checklist. But there is gold, orange, red, and supers in the autos. So the only thing that has a color above a gold parallel are the base cards. And those have the green and blue. Everything else for a parallel is gold, orange, red, and super. Um, the auto odds, golds are 1 in 403, orange are 1 in 804, red are 1 in 4,000, and supers are 1 in 19,200 packs. Um, so right there, gold, 1 in 403, orange, red, and super. Now, with there being no regular refractors and... You know, you don't have all of the color. You don't have the purples. Um, what else is in there? there there's several. There, there's a few colors that are missing. Um, that alone means this product is way more limited than regular Topps Chrome. Um, 
again i don't know officially how many boxes there are but i think this product is going to have some value to it you have a very strong class of rookies with bachette lux jordan um robert horner aquino dustin may i mean there is a lot of good rookies in, in the chrome product so and then you also again like i said you have tatis's gold cup you have vlad's gold cup alonzo's gold cup uh, you have um eloy's gold cup and then you throw in the fact that mookie Betts, you know is in his la dodgers uniform um, i'm going to tell you we pulled a mookie orange wave out of regular tops chrome I was shocked. That card is between $150 and $200. So the LA effect is on with Mookie Betts as well. Um, a lot of good potential. Even if you do buy a box on the app, you know, on the third party market for six, seven hundred bucks and you open it up, um, you should have I'm not gonna say every box you're gonna make money on. Um, even at 600 bucks, but I'm gonna say you should have a really fun time opening it get color um, Hopefully hit some rookies now if it's anything like regular chrome There's been some doo-doo boxes out there not gonna lie um, But I think with this product being more limited you have way better odds and even at 600 bucks you're not much more than double what a regular hobby box of chrome cost so um, if you get in at the 250 price point, congratulations. I hope you take the chance that you were given and open the product. Um, if you choose to sell, you know, that that's, you know, your thing, your choice. Um, but I would say if, me personally, if I was able to have gotten one at 250, I would have ripped that before I got it out of the mailbox. Um, so good luck to everybody that's ripping it. Um, I do want to show just before anybody says all oh, this video you know whatever um right here is ben baller uh unboxing the first box and pulling that lewis robert um if i flip over to that screen um here is the video of that um that was posted one week ago here is my ebay purchase from sports source 2 so you can see I did purchase the card from Sports Source 2. Um, and again, here are what boxes are going for. So we got the card. It came in great condition. Next step is to get it slabbed up and um, add it to the shelf. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. If you are watching and you are not a subscriber, please hit the subscribe button. Please like the video. Also, make sure to share this around. Um, I want to make sure the, the main purpose from this one was to share the odds, let people to see um, what the odds were and everything um, so they can make a choice of whether they wanted to drop the money to buy the box. Um, show the differences of the card on camera live. Um, you know, so you could see the difference between a base chrome and a regular chrome. Um, so please, if if you know someone that might be interested, share the video, like it. Uh, let me know what you think of it. Are you going to open a product or are you going to open the box? Are you interested in buying the box? Um, are you going to just hold back and buy singles of guys you like? Um, so, yeah, guys, again, a um, little bit different this time, but... I hope you enjoy the video, and as always, stay safe, stay healthy, and until the next video, I'm out.